Hello, and welcome to Gex TV. Today's video is all about the Panda Mouse Pro. I will show you how to use it from Android 11 operating system. Just make sure that your device is OTG capable. In order for you to know if your device is OTG ready, the mouse cursor will appear once you plug in the OTG cable. Make sure to watch till the end. I will show you the things I used in order to make this work. Also I will provide links where you can purchase the OTG cable and USB hub. Now let's go to the Play Store to download the app called, Panda Mouse Pro. By the way, it is best to purchase the app from the Play Store, rather than using modded Panda Mouse Pro. Or, a free Panda Mouse Pro app. That way it is safer, and, for sure to work with your device. As you can see, I have a refund option, in case that didn't work for me. Luckily, the developer of Panda Mouse Pro made an update, and now it is working for Android 11 operating system. Now let's install the app, and I will show you step-by-step -step procedure. Make sure to watch the full video. As you can see it is now installing. Once it is done, click open. Now, you need to allow, all permissions for Panda Mouse Pro. See the activation is red. It means we need to activate the Panda Mouse Pro. I will show you how to. But you will need to have a computer for this to work. In my case, I will use a Windows 10 operating system. Once you are here, it will give you an option to use a computer. Unless, you want to purchase the Panda Mouse Pro, Activator, device. In this video, I will use a computer for free activation. You will need to enable developer mode on your phone. And here is a sample, on how to enable, developer options for your device. Let's go to, the settings of your phone. Click about phone. Then tap on build number, Android version, or system version for 7 times, until you see the word. You are now, a developer. Now go back to settings, and look for the developer options. In my Redmi Note 9S, I go to additional settings to find the developer options. Once you are in the developer options. You will need to enable USB debugging, and, USB debugging security settings. This will allow the activation for Panda Mouse Pro. If you don't have USB debugging security settings, that is okay. Just enable USB debugging. Now, let's go back to Panda Mouse Pro, and check the activation. At this point, we will now connect your phone to the computer, and will show you what you need to download using your PC. This is the easy way to activate your Panda Mouse Pro for free. From here, you will see the link for the activation file, to download. Just copy it, and type it on your PC browser. Now, let's move to your computer. From here, just open a browser. In my case, I will use Chrome, web browser. Then, I will type in, the link, or, the URL.
Then, you will now see the activator for Windows and the activator for Mac. There are also some steps how to activate it using Mac computer. But in our case, we will use the activator for Windows. Now, just follow me, and I will download the activator for Windows here. This will be easy, and I know you can do it too. Just watch carefully, and you will be okay. Because, once you download it, you will need to extract it to a folder. Just watch the video, carefully. And subscribe to my channel, thank you. Now, as you can see, it is already extracted, and it's on a folder. Just open the folder, and double click, or open the activate file, while your phone is connected, to the computer that you are using. Please, make sure that you have done the previous steps on your phone, and make sure to be connected to the computer, via, USB cable, that has the folder for the activator. If done correctly, this will show on your PC. But, if not, it will give you errors. You can just try to follow the steps again. You will know that, it is done correctly if it shows the activation is complete. Also on your phone it will show activation complete. Congratulations, now you can use Panda Mouse Pro. Make sure to use the paid version of the app to be able to use Panda Mouse Pro on the latest Android version. Let's go back to your phone, and connect the, OTG cable, and the USB hub, with the mouse and keyboard. As you can see, it detects the mouse and keyboard. Now select the game you wanted to use Panda Mouse Pro. Now, enable the floating widgets, and, disable the battery optimization, for, Panda Mouse Pro. This will show when a game has a mouse cursor available. You can right-click to enter, shooting mode. It is available to games like, PUBG, or, Call of Duty Mobile. But, you can change the key, to enter shooting mode. Watch carefully as I will show you how to set up the keys, for, Key Mapping Panda Mouse Pro. And if you liked the video, please like and subscribe to Gex TV. Thank you so much. You can do what I do, or make your own setup. But for me, I set up my key mapping, like this.
Mybox here. 